Okay, so um, we need to get a scanner object. So we just want to type in scanner, uh, scanner gets new scanner parentheses, just like that. I believe that is the deal. Nope, we want to put in system.in. Okay, so if I come back over here, we'll type in system.in. All right, so that's what we want. Um, and then we should get an import here. Did it auto import? It did not auto import that class. Okay, so up here we're need, going to need to go import. Um, and then if we look, it's java.util.scanner. So I'm just going to copy this line. I just Googled this. Um, so I'll copy that line and then let's paste it in. Uh, boom. I got a double import statement now. There we go. All right, so this brings the scanner object into our system. Uh, so we should be able to get input now uh, by uh, doing scanner dot uh, next line, just like this. Um, that will do it. Uh, so what we want to do is this. All right, so now we want to replace this loop here with a while loop. So I want to go while. Um, and then I want to do something like while uh, play, for example. Okay. Um, we don't have a variable for this, though. But while playing, run the game. All right. So what we need to do is define a, a Boolean variable for playing and set it equal to true. Okay. Because we're playing the game. All right. We're starting the game. We're going to play the game. We're going to play the game until we're done playing. So actually... If we come over here now, if we build this, it will run infinitely because playing is always true. Okay, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to show you that, but you can try it out. You should try it out. Um, and then, uh, of course, break that loop and then come back over here and let's finish it. All right, so what we want to do is uh, do something like string. Um, well, system.out.println. .out.println. Uh, do you wish to play again? All right, and then we're going to do uh, an input. So scanner dot uh, next line like this. All right, so what this is going to do basically is it's going to pause the game between hits uh, while we look for the character. Okay, um, so let's see how this works. All right, so if I come over here and we'll do a Java C hmm. it might want that to be capitalized. Well, that's interesting. We have to type the whole word? That's weird. Okay. That's weird. All right, but they want us to type the whole weird. This is like the only language where you have to do that. It's totally bool in like every other language. Okay, there we go. So um, we've got it built. And now if I run Java card game, okay, it says, do you wish to play again? It actually doesn't matter what we type here. It'll just play again. It'll play again infinitely. Okay, so it will never stop. This program will never stop. It's it's uh, so we're gonna have to go Control B to break it. Nope, that's not it. What was it? Um, I don't remember how to break it. Nope. Ha ha. Replit. Break. Uh, console.
Let's see here. Ah, what is the hotkey for it? I knew this the other day. Uh, where's the hotkey? Just tell me what the hotkey is. Maybe it was control C. Yeah, it was control C. Ha. All right, so control C breaks the uh, loop. There it is. All right, sorry about all that dead air. Okay, so. Um, that gets us the next line. All right, and now we want to do something with it. So let's go string um, uh, input uh, equals, okay, something like that. And then we'll say if um, input, now, um, and we'll go input uh, equals uh, no. Okay, then we'll say playing gets false okay and then if i run this now java c oh, it does not like that at all java c card game dot java oh wow pardon me okay all right ting ace Do you wish to play again? Oh, 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 oh. Ha, I know what's wrong. Um, also, I also know what's wrong here. I'm, I'm running a, this version of the app doesn't have the uh, finished game. All right, but anyway, we'll just keep going. So if I type, um, if I type anything, it'll play again. If I type no, it'll play again. Okay. That's awesome. Pause the video, hang on. Okay, I did a couple of things here to change the code. I put in the, the missing code so that my program is running properly now, um, but we're still bugged here, and I'm sorry about this guy. We're gonna make that go away. All right, there we go. Um, so what I'm gonna do here is I'm just going to print the input so that we can see what it is seeing. What is scanner.nextline? storing an input because it failed um, to set playing to false um, on input equals no. So uh, that is a problem. We want to try to see if we can solve it. Okay, so let's do a Java C on card game Java. And then we'll run it. Okay, so if I type no, then oh, see it printed no. Hmm, that's very curious. Um, I'm wondering if, if we did this, would it work? Does, is that change gonna be the thing that fixes it? Now, don't worry if you don't understand what I just did. Um, this is just a quick test. To see what scanner.println is bringing in. Okay, no, it didn't work. Okay, so why is this string equality not functioning right? All right, let's see. Um, let's do Java compare strings. Okay. Oh, that's weird. It's returning. Hmm. Um, so it's returning a number. Uh, 
and not boolean. It should still work. Well, we'll use string one dot equals. That's weird. Uh, Java has these little in, in, inconsistencies though, um, where it's uh, it's just not quite firing on the same cylinders that other uh, more modern languages are. So obviously it has a problem comparing strings. Uh, so let's try this again. All right, so if I type no now, all right, so we've that it does end the program. Okay, so that did end the program there. Um, let's try it again. If I type anything else, all right, it's going to want us to play again. All right, so there we go. That uh, that does it. Um, okay, let's clean this up. We're going to take this line of code out. We don't need it anymore, uh, but we might want to uh, do something like system dot out dot print line. Um, and then say thanks for playing. So some kind of final uh, exit output so the player knows that we're done. Um, and then let's see here. This should do. And then if I type no, thanks for playing. Awesome. There you go. See you in the next video.